Well, Catholic High School's building will now operate as the new Pope Francis High School starting next school year. 22 News reporter Caitlin Gosley is live in the newsroom with the latest. Rich, over the summer, Springfield's bishop announced that he wanted to make the Cathedral High School students, he wanted to have the Cathedral High School students attend school at Holyoke Catholic High School while the two groups of students waited for their new Pope Francis High School school to be built. Today, the leaders of the new merger Catholic High School announced they will be able to make that happen. The leader of that school announced this morning a report was done following Bishop Brzezanski's request to ensure that that move would be able to work. The report looked at the capacity of Holyoke Catholic High School's building, transportation issues, food service options, staffing in the curriculum, among other things. He also told 22 News that the work to combine students under one roof and make Pope Francis High School become official by the start of next year has already begun. We start looking at the combined budgets. Uh, we have a meeting set up very soon to talk, talking about staffing. Uh, the curriculum committees are already meeting. Uh, they've done a lot of work so far. Right now, the Holyoke Catholic High School building can hold about 400 students. The school leaders told 20 News today that they are anticipating a total enrollment for Pope Francis High School to be about 375 students next fall. On 20 News starting at 5 tonight, find out what the status of that new school, that new Pope Francis High School building is right now. Live in the newsroom, Caitlin Gosley, 20 News.